Siobhan from Jimmy Beans Wool, and I am here today to talk about one of my favorite yarns of all time. This is the Manos del Uruguay Silk Blend. Um, it comes in variegated skeins, which are very, very pretty, and they also come in solids, which are also very, 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 very pretty. So pretty. I know, I have one skein of this, which I'll show you in my project, and I also have a skein of purple. You don't like purple. I love purple. You know no, this. You, don't. you know this. Jeannie's lying. She's lying. No. And anyways, <laughs> this is a wool and silk blend. Um, it's 30% silk, 75, 70% merino, extra fine wool, kettle dyed. Um, which I will go into kettle dyed in a second. But um, because it's wool, it's really, 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 really soft and warm for any project: gloves, hats, cowls, sweaters, anything you want. This is the art. And with that silk, it's a really nice sheen. So it's just it's just beautiful. It's glossy. It has that glossy texture. It makes it soft. I just I love it. Anyways, um, this is actually our most popular silk blend color. It's the wildflowers. It's just it always goes just because it's so beautiful. I mean, look at all those colors. It is really cool. Um and Mano Still Uruguay is also one of my favorite companies because it's a fair trade cooperative um, run by all women and it's just to promote um, local trade and kind of promote jobs um, and artisan handicraft for women in Uruguay. So it's just a really great it's a really great company and I really like what they do so I like to support that. And you get a really great fantastic product while you support it. So it's like you can't go wrong either way. And kettle dyed means that it's individually hand dyed in small batches. So small they have like a little kettle, I guess, and they dye it in there. But um, since it's individually hand dyed, they don't have dye lots. They just come in batches, and we kind of um, pick the ones that look the best, and we will let you know if there's any sort of difference whatsoever in your skein. And so you can opt to wait, or you can just opt to uh, go right ahead and have some fun with hand dyed yarn techniques. Um, because Jeannie made some really awesome videos <laughs> that you should check out because they're really cool. And anyways, I have been dying to work with this ever since I started here. So I finally got to um, to make some. I'm making this for my friend. It was supposed to be a Christmas gift and it is now the end of May. So she knows, but it's now going to be some other gift. I don't know. She'll still get it. But a just because gift. A just because gift. But um, I did one um, strand of Mana Silk Blend, just a black, and then one strand of Kitzel Haze, that's a Rowan yarn, in like Dewberry. And this is just the Church Mouse Annabelle's cowl, but it's really fuzzy and soft, and this is going to be super cozy. She's a purple fan too, which is probably like why we're best friends, because we're both purple. That's a lovers. really be beautiful color choice there. Yeah, the so I love the black and purples mm -hmm. together. So I just thought I'd see, experiment, see how it looks, and it looks awesome. So, I mean, I really love this yarn, and I really think you'll love it too. Um, and also, another disclaimer, it's hand spun and hand, um, or put into its skeins by individuals. So, um... The yardage is not exact, um, but just let us know. Sometimes you just, I would say, overcompensate if you're buying skeins for a project. I would buy maybe a few more and just don't wind the last skein, and you're more than welcome to return it if you don't use it. Um, but if you have any more questions about Manos or any of their hand or any of our hand dyed yarns, just give us a call. So I'm Siobhan, and this is Manos Silk Blend. Have a great day. Bye. Bye. Thunder rumbles on this American summer night It's kids on the corner Stuck in a switchblade fight And the rock and roll bands Play for the girls on the beach